Hi everyone, this is Bob Gunzenhauser, Agronomy Science Manager for Granular. Today I want to talk to you about some fundamentals of soil sampling. It's very important to take soil samples to get an understanding of where our fertility levels are at. This year, fall 2021, is no different of time. We need to be looking at where our fertility levels are at and making good decisions about what fertilizer to apply. Let's look at some of the details. A key thing about soil sampling is to be consistent. Have a consistent depth that you're always working towards, the number of, of cores that you take, and the position you take those cores at. Right now I'm positioned right around my pickup truck here. And I like to go and take about 30 foot radius around my truck to take about eight cores. I like to take them about every different coordinate direction there. That way I know I'm getting a, a good distribution of all the where the sample uh, are at. It's also key as when you take a soil sample is to clear off the residue that you'll often find. Uh, so you're not actually pushing through the residue, but you are uh, going and getting a clean sample into the soil. Once we have the cores pulled, we'll want to bag them up into our sample bags. Here I've already got a sample bag already made out with a pre-attached label. We'll go ahead and put this in the soil bag. As you can see, the soil is about three quarters away in the bag. I like to fill it up to the fill to line there. Uh, any more than that is just wasted, and any less than that may not have as much to go do a good analysis. You know how the old saying goes, you can't manage what you don't measure. This is a way to ma measure where we're at so we can manage it better. Especially as we go into the 22 crop season, we're going to need to be able to manage our inputs very wisely. Taking soil samples now will help, under, help us understand where the fertility levels are at, what do we need to apply, and what we need to manage for this next year. 